Hello guys, I'm Gabe Espanyo. So, nandito ko para ituro sa inyo ang functions and relations. So, ano nga ba ang functions and relations? A function and relation is a set of two ordered pairs of inputs and outputs and represent relationship between two values. So, ang relation is a set of input and outputs. Tapos, ang function naman is relation with one output in each input. So, ito ang example. So, paano ba natin malalaman pag function or not function? So, meron tayong apat na paraan. Uh, one to one, one to many, many to many, tsaka many to one. So, pag function, pwede lang siya sa one to one, tsaka one to many. So, kapag many to many or many to one, automatic, not function na siya. So, ganito guys yung example niya. Ito nga example ng function and relation. So, Malalaman niya natin kapag function or, or not function. Kapag function, pag wala siya naulit sa domain. So, may naulit ba sa domain? So, wala. So, automatic function na siya. So, function, yes. So, gan ganyan lang natin siya i-graph. So, 2, 5, tsaka 4. Tapos, 3, 4, 1. So, connect lang natin siya. Ayan. So, yun yung example ng function. Evaluation of function is the replacement of values of the variable x with any element of the domain and computing for the result. So, pamayitan natin si x na any number or any number of the domain. So, ito yung example. mx equals to x squared plus 4 plus f negative 3. So, ito yung given. Tapos, ito yung hanapin. So, kabayin ko muna yung given. Negative 3, tapos yung 2 square, nalagay lang dito, tapos plus 4, tapos Negative plus negative is positive, so magiging 9 siya. Tapos, copy na yung plus 4, tapos 2 times 9 plus 18. Tapos, copy na yung plus 4. Magiging F negative 3 equals 22. function are functions with overlapping domains that can be added, subtracted, multiplied, and divided. So, if fx and gx are two functions, then for all x in the domain of both functions, the sum, difference, product, and quotient are defined as follows. No baby. So, ganito siya. Ito yung Ito yung addition, subtraction, multiplication, at division. So, ito yung, so, yung difference, um, sum niya. F plus G, parenthesis, X equals to Fx plus Gx. Tapos, pag, may, pag minus naman, ganito lang. Tapos, yung e, times, ganito lang din. Tapos, yung multiplication ganito. So, magbigay tayo ng example. Para hindi natin makalimutin yung example, sulat muna natin. Fx equals to 2 la 2x plus 1 tapos g gx equals to x squared negative 4. So, yan. Yan. Tapos, ang Pukunin natin is F plus G X So, para makuha natin yung F plus G X Sulat mo natin yung F So, magiging equals to 2X plus 1 So, sunod natin yung G 
So, para, ma para maisulat natin to, itong x squared equals to positive na yan. Kasi wala siyang negative sa unahan. So, plus x2 minus 1. So, ganyan mangyayari. So, para makuha natin itong f plus g x, dapat i-arrange natin siya. So, mangyayari is equals to x squared. So, mauna yung x squared kasi siya yung mas mataas kaysa dito. Kasi isang x lang siya, ito dalawang x. So, x squared plus 2x plus 1 minus 4. So, ganyan yung mayayari dyan. Na x squared plus 2x plus 1 minus 4. So, ito lang yung magkaparehas kaya magiging 5. Kasi parehas silang parehas sila ng sign, parehas sila ng digit. So, itong dalawang to, wala silang magkaparehas. Kaya, stay lang yan. So, magiging, ang sagot natin is F minus G X equals to negative X squared plus 2X plus 5. So, ayun yung sagot. Huwag lang natin kakalimutan itong negative pag magma-minus na tayo. Kasi pag minus, kailangan may negative dito para mabago yung sign. Next is multiplication.